This is my shop tour. This is my dust collector shed. This is my dust collector. It's a two-stage dust collector. I made it into a two-stage dust collector. It's a Harbor Freight. My workshop is two sheds put together. It's a 10 by 8 in the front and a 10 by 14 in the back. Just doing an overall view of my shop. Kind of doing the spin. Throwing some dust collection pipes. There's my air conditioners for heating and cooling. Showing my homemade blast gate. There's the store bought one. Showing my um, two um, table saw slid. There's my blade. It's a Harbor Freight lathe. There's my DeWalt miter saw. The fence on the left side right there is homemade key track with a homemade. There's my sanders. Have the DeWalt five inch and a rigid six inch and a black and decker mouse. There's some stuff on the wall. There's some drills and chisels. And there's my toolbox, mechanic toolbox. And then there's my router table, Craftsman router table. I have two other routers there. Have some squares and stuff on the wall there. Pegboard and there's a little shelving right there. There's my chisel and chargers and a pick towel rack. Right there is my sanding paper for six inch and five inch orbital sanders. There's my port of cable 14 inch fan salt. There's my Craig jig. drill press right there. I put some shelves in on my bandsaw. There's my drill press table. There's my Harbor Freight drill press. My Black and Decker jigsaw. Boxing device. It's all my stuff for drilling. My nail guns. There's my assembly table with my drills on the side. Kids' woodworking stuff in there in their toolboxes. It's underneath there. And my clamp rack and there's my screws. My tool belt. There's my air conditioner. It only cools. There's the other side of my assembly table. Here's my table saw and my outfeed table folded up folded out I like having my assembly table folding so it, I can fold it down out of the way or fold it up to use it there's my track homemade track for my circular saw there's my furniture cart for when I take it off the assembly table and put it on the floor I don't have to I can push it around there it is there here's my uh, 
finishing cabinet. There's my lumber rack. The bottom underneath there is for dimensional. I don't know if you can see where I can put plywood on top. There's my assembly table folded down. There's my delta table saw. There's my workbench. Also, it doubles as an assembly table. I mean, an in feed table. Delta table saw. There's my fan. Down there's my old table saw. It's a craftsman. There's my air compressor hose. On wheel so I can pull it out and set a piece of plywood on it and it's even with the table saw so I don't have to hold the plywood up I just push it through the table saw that's where I can put my drills and clamps and stuff when I'm not using them there's my planer there's my joiner there's my drawer I have one hand planer in it so far I want to get some more planers that's just a cheapo, but I want to I want to get some better ones, some nicer ones. There's my tail vise there. It's a, just a pipe clamp. There's a homemade bench dog there. Got a lot of holes in there for putting the clamps through there. Just some regular F-style clamps to go through there. Bar clamp does a nice job of holding the wood in while you're planing. It, it holds it nice. What you're doing, chills will work. That workbench is six foot long. There it is with an F-style clamp holding the wood down so I can put that anywhere and I, I knock the pin out of it and put a bolt through it and then a wing nut so I can take the wing nut and bolt out and put the F-style clamp in and out of there. Whatever hole I want to use. There's a tour of my workshop and thanks for watching. Have a great day.